Welcome, in front of me I have Huawei Watch 5 and I'm gonna show you how to pair this watch with the iPhone. First thing you will need to do is to turn on your watch and you can turn it on by pressing and holding the crown button. Keep holding the button until you see the Huawei logo on the screen. Once you see the logo, you can release the button and wait until the watch is done uh, booting up. In the meantime, we need to download and install the Huawei Health application on our iPhone we want to pair our watch with. So go to your iPhone, make sure you have the internet connection and Bluetooth enabled. Once you do, uh, open the App Store. In the App Store, tap on the search icon, then tap on the search bar and type in Huawei Health. Oh, my bad. And then tap of search, on search, of course, and you should see this application, Huawei Health. Uh, for me, it's Europe because I'm in Europe, but I believe in other countries it's going to be just Huawei Health. Tap on it tap on the get button to install it Okay, and once the application is done installing, we can tap on open to open it. In the app, you will need to select the service re region. You can tap right here, scroll through the list, look for the region you want to use, then tap on it uh, to select it. And then you can tap on next, next, agree, allow or uh, order ID permission for the notifications. And now you should see the health page. Tap on devices tap on add device and as you can see we need to log in into Huawei ID account if you don't have an account you can tap on register right here make a new one and then use it to log in I already have account so I'm gonna enter my email address and password Okay, and then we can tap on uh, login. And after you log in, you will see this page, tap on next. Agree. And as you can see, we need to deal with the health permissions too. So tap on continue. And basically you will see the list of different functions. You can allow and deny the app to read and write the data for these functions like active energy, uh, flights com climb and stuff like that. If you want to use the health features on your uh, smartwatch, you will need to allow some of these permissions, all, all of them, depending on what type of information you want to gather. If you don't care, you can tap on don't allow, but I'm gonna just turn it on all, tap on allow. And once you're done with that, you will see the health page. Now tap on device again, uh, tap on uh, add device. For some reason I have still devices connected to my account, but I'm just gonna tap on add device. Allow the required permission for the Bluetooth. This one needs to be allowed for the Bluetooth to work, so allow it. And tap on add device again. It will start scanning for the nearby devices. On the watch, if, it, if you see the list of languages, scroll through the list, find the language you would like to use and 
tap on it. And now the app should detect your watch automatically. And once it does, tap on connect. On the watch, tap on the check mark to confirm. Tap on pair on the iPhone. Allow or deny the permission for the notifications. This is useful if you want to receive the notifications from your iPhone on your watch. Then we need to scroll down, check the box, tap on next. And we need to tap on next, but you can enable the location services and join the user in experience program if you want to. I'm not gonna check these. I'm just gonna tap on next. Okay. Next we have the location permission. You can allow it or deny it. And then we have the access to contacts. This is useful if you want to, for example, start calls uh, on your watch and stuff like that. I'm just gonna tap on don't allow for now. Then we have the calendar access. This is useful if you want to see the notifications about the events from your calendar. If you don't care, you can deny it. If you want to use it, tap on allow, then tap on done. Okay. And as you can see, we can sync the Huawei ID account with our device. I'm gonna sync it. Okay, here we have a subscription thing. I don't really care about it, so I'm gonna tap on back. And at this point, you should be at the device page. On it, you should see your Huawei Watch 5. And of course, on your watch, you can go through the tutorial how to use the watch. And once you're done, you should be able to use it, but it's still gonna configure, so we need to wait a few more seconds. Okay, so let's wait until it's done. And now we can press the Chrome button. Scroll down, tap on continue, Co agree, okay. And you should see the watch face and your watch should be ready to use. And that's how you pair um, this watch with the iPhone. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel and leaving the like on the video.